Hey guys, what's going on? SickMind33 here, and it's time for another freeware review of the week. For each week, I take the best free stuff off the internet and show it to you guys so you don't have to pay a single cent. Today's software is something known as a port forwarding service. A port forwarding service is when you're trying to set up a server where everyone, because everyone wants to get on a server for some a program like Minecraft open canvas games that require a server but you want to run through your own computer you can set up a server set it to run through log something such as this program which I'll open right now it'll start up the program you there's um you can this is your IPv4 and your IPv6 for just about everything you're gonna need your IPv4 let's get rid of this network and see this system, which you don't need to do. You can attach it to a login account, but you do not need one. There's network, manage networks, help. Let's go to network. You can join an existing network, in which you'll need the network ID and password. There's let's create a network. When you create a network, you have to make up a name. So let's go with um, Hamachi. Hamachi. Then password something like one two three four, something simple because you're not gonna expect anyone to get in. Like because no one not like set up a simple password. Like if you're gonna have friends, a bunch of friends get on, because this is like the most popular piece of software used to set up something like say a Minecraft server. Now let's just say use this. You see. If an, you can't share a network name with other people because if someone's sharing the same network name, they could be sharing the same password. So Hamachi prevents this from happening. So let's do something like that. See, we've created a network. We're automatically joined. And then we can go online. And we can open a chat. We can set access. And we always require a password. Always require a password. Then let's see, we can delete the network and open a chat window. This chat window is you press you you type in a message, press enter. This chat window is very is um a small one. It's pretty good. It works. Just the little one for uh, communicating. Then um that's about it. You get five. People, you get a five slot limit. That's about all you get. Then you can go offline. Should be the same as clicking this, I believe. Nope. Uh, actually, now you have to click this. I don't know what this is. I think this is for showing who's online. Or you can just double click it and it goes on or offline. Delete the network. If you delete the network, you can't recover it. So and basically, don't touch this while you're running something through Hamachi. Oh, so it's, yeah. See, irreversibly destroy the selected network. And then network no longer exists. Hamachi is a really nice program. Even when you press X accidentally, it is still there. It says it's ready. So just click. You can restore. Power it off where it won't, like, if I power it off, it's still there, but it's not running. So if I want to get back to it later, or just exit, and it's not there. So Amachi is a fairly useful software for say a Minecraft server. So actually, no, open Canvas. This is a good um a pin, way to show you. Let me open up log me and Hamachi. Now let's go log me and Hamachi. Create a new network. Huh. Oh, I have to put turn it back online. I need that. See so how this power button turns it on or off. It lets you know when you're you basically can't use it till your network name comes up. Uh, let's do let's set up a quick password. You always have to set up a password. It's required. Create that and now that I have a network, I believe I can Working window. Yep. 
and now I am hosting a server. I have a little chat box here, like, hello. A little chat box there. A little bit here. See, this IP right here, my IPv4, is the same as my IPv4 here. Because it's using this IP, because I set it up like that. And that's how that works. Let's get rid of this. Uh, let's see. I guess I have a client. See, I can connect someone else. All this good stuff. Set up a server. And this is how this works. See, that's how that works to set up a server like that. Basically, you just use this as your your IP. And if there's like, if you need something like, I don't know, like a port, set up the port. That's how everything works basically for this. Then you can just delete the network. And then that's basically it. This is not a lot of Machi, it's very basic. It's it's very useful for those who who actually know who actually want who know how to use it per se. So that's about it for this week. And um yeah. This has been Sickmind33 with your freeware review of the week. And I bid you adieu.